Hey, I'm finally back to this game. Finally. Um, so we're back with multiple let's play Fire Emblem. I haven't recorded a lot. I'm starting off college and I'm trying to take as many healthy breaks as possible to take care of my health. And to be sure I'm not overstressing myself so you guys get the best content possible. Well, that's way too close. Hold on, let me... Uh... No, this is good. Okay. Now. You look as if you're feeling better after a few days to yourself, Dry. I am, yes. And in real life. Still have many questions, but at least now I have a few answers. Thank you for giving me the space I need to think. Of course, I'm glad to hear that you're feeling better. And if you wouldn't mind, I have a small favor to ask. Would you... Try sitting on the throne for a moment. Why would I do that? Well, this throne is infused with the power of the first dragons. It is said that those who sit on it regain their true form and mind. I thought if you sat on the throne, then perhaps... Wait, do you not trust me? Do you think I'm under some kind of Norian spell? No, it has nothing to do with trust. I just wonder if the Norians have been stealing away your early memories. If so... Maybe this special throne could help bring those lost pieces back. Those sweet memories of me and your siblings. I see. I'm so very sorry. I'm sorry, Dry. I don't mean to push you towards something you don't want. Excuse me, Lady Makoto. The ceremony is about to begin. Thank you, Yukimara. Dry, you probably don't remember him, but this is Yukimara. He's one of the strategists and brightest leaders. We would be lost without him. You're too kind, my lady. Though in truth, I still have much to learn. That said, I'm here to help in any way I can, Lady Dry. There's the siblings. I'd like to make a public announcement about your presence here, Dry. There have been rumors circulating about sp spies from Nor infiltrating the castle. I would like to quash those rumors once and for all. Yukimura, is everything ready? Yes, milady. People are beginning to gather at the plaza. Excellent. Thank you. Dry, I arranged for Takumi, Hinoka, and Sakura to give you a tour. I thought you might want to get to know the area a little bit before this event. I need to speak at Yukimura first, but I'll meet you at the plaza soon. We'd be happy to show her, show her around. Thank you, mother. Not at all. Be my pleasure. I did fucking skip dialogue. Sorry, guys. Fuck. Thank you, Azura. Of course, dry. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, this guy is gonna be very angry at us. I don't know. I have a feeling we might be versing him later. You'll see. I can't wait to show you around. I think you'll love it here. Thank you, Sakura. A guided tour sounds like a great idea. Oh boy. This ain't gonna end well. I hope Dry is truly okay with all this. Yes, I can imagine the position she's in. It's a lot to process. That said, I think her return is a message from the gods. A good message, I hope. Why do you say that? Do you say that? I don't know. After the evasion up north... I just feel uneasy. We should remain on high alert, if you ask me. Another cutscene. Hey, young lady, would you like to try my world's famous roasted potatoes? Delicious and nutritious. I guarantee you'll love them. <laughs> well, sure, why not? Hmm. I've never tasted spices like these before. This is amazing. <laughs> Told ya. Here, take an extra one of the house. Share it with your friend. Well, thank you very much. Here you go, Azura. <laughs> thank you, Dry. You're right, this is delicious. Huh. <laughs> no kidding. Everyone re really is friendly here. It's so bright and open. 
It's quite a contrast from the fortress I grew up in. I'm glad you like it. I said, I've always been happy here. Just don't get too comfortable, sister. Pardon me? I don't trust you. Shouldn't you be heading back to Nora soon? Takumi. Hey, who said you could call me by my name? You haven't earned that privilege either. That doesn't even make sense. Excuse me? Azura has been in Hoshio for as long as I've been gone. Shouldn't that be enough to consider her a part of the family? I don't care. I don't trust you either. Either of you. I just wanted to tell you that that's your face. I apologize for Takumi's rudeness. He's a bit of a hothead. Anyway, how would you like to try a sweet rice dumpling? It's Hoshiden specialty. I'd love to. Thanks, Sakura. You're welcome. You know, I've been close with the girl in Nor who is around your age. Oh, what she's like. Well, she's generous and kind, always putting the needs of others. Alright, everyone. The ceremony is starting. Let's head to the palace. Plaza, you mean? Yeah. Oh, this is gonna end badly. Why did, I, why did I say that? Well, it's just gonna end badly. You know these RPGs? A parent of RPG, either... You know what? I'm... The fuck that... Just shut up, bro. That hooded guy. Oh, what the fuck? It just grabbed Grimlair! What the fuck? Oh, what the shit? What the fuck? And she dies. Oh, fucking Christ. Holy fuck. We're a fucking dragon, what the fuck? Also, I'm gonna say this, because it needs to be said. I bet those people who really are uh, playing Smash Bros and playing this game, they're like, that's what you get, you fucking bitch. That's what you get for being in Smash. Fucking parents killed. Fucking deserved, you little shit. So it's like, you know the guy that killed uh, Korin's mom? He's, that's, a, that's a Smash player who keeps yeah, fire. Yeah, players. he's a Smash player who killed fire players. Like, oh, she want to be in Smash? I'll fucking take away your parents. Take that bitch. You know who you are, people who hate Fire Emblem characters. Oh my god. You don't Dude. Have to hate them, just. All right. So let's process this. Let's let's teach. Let's talk to people who don't know this game. So. Technically, we were been taken away from our parents from when we were kids. King Garen kills our father, if it's so to speak, right? So he kills him. And then technically then he guy. takes us away, seals our early memories, sealed us into a fucking fortress for who knows how long. And we have a dream that, oh, we're going to fight with both our families. We get captured, return back to our family, only to have this hooded guy, which probably isn't part of Nor, to kill our mother... And then for Wait, us to get I... so angry, we turn into a bloodthirsty fucking can, can dragon. Can I just say something? Can I just say something? The hooded guy might be important in the next, in the yeah. next fire, in the next variation of uh, this fire uh, emblem game. Yes, and the ne in the second part of this let's play, that it's hooded guy. True. Fire emblem let's play. Um, for that, um, I might show a cutscene with the male losing its mother and showing that variant off in the early let's play. I might do that. Uh, so. Because I'm playing the girl, because it's very important why I'm playing the girl now. Because there's contracts to playing both male and female in this game. 
That's why I'm playing the female now. I'll play the male in Revelations. So, now Joe gets it. Mm -hmm. Now, he knows why I'm playing the female first. But... Wait, Zach, you guys can still buy the DLCs in Fire Emblem. You know that, right? In that Fire Emblem. No, I, yeah, I can't. I can't put any cards in the 3DS anymore. Oh, shit. So, yeah. That's a little hard to take take over. We'll fight in the next video. Holy fucking shit. Poor Corin. Later.